Hey folks, Tony here again from Dr. Uniforms. We're just going to shoot a little bit of uh, some videos here in the store today uh, just to kind of get back up on YouTube, Facebook, things like that. But we do have some 511 stuff that we have on sale right now. We just brought this company in. Um, we brought in their, their ATAC series and their EVO series. We got their 6 inches and we got their 8 inch in, in these. These are the 8 inch ATAC. This is, these are some of their, their best selling boots that they have. They're a great boot. You want to come in and check these out. Right now, um, while we're doing these ads, these are all going to be 20% off what we got left here in the store. Um, these are the first batch that we got in so far trying the 511s out amongst all the other brands that we carry as well. This is, um, you can actually do a zoom in on that one there if you want to kind of look at that. Um, but it does have the sides up and does have nice tread on the bottom as well. You can kind of see that. And it's got the, here's your heel. It's a good solid boot. It's a good solid boot, eight inch. I actually wore these. These are pretty good boot. They're good, they're good uh, addition to some of the stuff we have in the store. And the six inch one, this is the Evos. And you can zoom in on that one there a little bit. And that's what that one looks like. Again, sides up. Um, not too not too expensive, and with 20% off on these, you'll see the the you know the price come down on these a little bit while we introduce this brand in the store. We do have the 511 Tactical Pants as well. Those having a hard time finding those, uh, you want to stop on down. We can show you those. And as well as as 511, we do have a great new Reebok edition, which is very light, light as air almost. This is a um, memory foam. It's got the memory foam, and it's got a massaging. Uh, it's got a massaging insole. You can almost see the little little divots on here, little button. Uh, it's like little buttons you can feel. But you can actually see inside there. You can actually see on, on the in the inside there. It's got the Reebok insole. These are removable insoles, but they are memory foam and side zip, full waterproofing. Great tread on the bottom of these. It's a high performance eight inch boot. So you want to come in, stop in, and check these out. We've already gone through two or three different batches of these since we've had these for the past several months. I personally war test these before we got them in the store. Make sure they're comfortable. Make sure there's no issues on the end step. Uh, no, make sure there's no issues with the zipper. It's a great company. It's made by the Warson Group. They manufacture only footwear. They don't make hats. They don't make sunglasses. They don't make t-shirts, pants, things like that. They only focus themselves making good footwear. And this was probably one of the first companies that we had here in the store many years ago. I bet you we've had, carried this line for maybe 18 years. Uh, we got a couple of, of the uh, Old Faithful boots, we call them, the 6-inch and the 8-inch from Reebok. They used to be uh, um, Converse years ago. So you want to come on down. Like I said, these are great boots by Reebok. And like I was saying uh, many years ago, this used to be licensed under Converse. For those that shopped with us many years ago, they got basically the same boot, same footwear. It just said Converse on them. They just went and licensed now. They are approved by Reebok. They have to go through strict um, agreements with Reeboks before these things are put out on the market. That's why these boots sell really well compared to all the other brands that you see out there. You want to come on down. You want to you want to check these out, and you'll see for yourself um, how great these boots are and how lightweight. I can almost probably take a thread and have these hanging in here. You know, I should probably try that one of these days to see if it works because it's they're that light. Now, the Old Faithfuls here are the 6-inch and the 8-inch. Eight, eight these boots we've had for probably 18 years, 16, 17 years maybe. We've been here a long time, so this was one of the first companies we've had here in the store. Great boot, slip resistant. They're all uh, waterproof. Um, they got waterproofing leather and all that stuff, but very aggressive bottoms to these. You can probably zoom in on these. You can show, show the, the bottoms of these here. But very, very solid boot. You know, you can see this boot here. This is the 8 inch one, full side zip. It's got all the tags. It shows all the features to them, but you can see how aggressive these boots are. So anybody that's in law enforcement, <coughs> um, EMS, like that, or anybody that just wants a really good boot, um, you'll see the performance values that you get with these. And this is your, this is your. You can back up a little bit. This is your six, um, your six inch version of that. It's almost like years ago when I used to be. I was a kid. Used to get the high tops from Reebok. Actually, you know, I was a, I was the Reebok man. Um, I never really got into the Nikes, but I was I was Reebok back when I was a kid, and we had the the high tops like these. And that's kind of what this is. But it's a it's a high performance boot shoe. 
again with all the features, slip resistant bottoms, non-marking, all that good stuff. So these are the old Reliables. It's probably their number one selling boots that they've had over the years. They, they carry many different things. They carry many different shoes. They do some military ones. They do desert, the desert storm color. Uh, I think they do the olive, the olive green, the, the, the tan, I guess it's called the desert storm. And we've actually ordered those for individuals here in the store as well. And another brand that we absolutely love, and I'm actually wearing Thoroughgoods today, but this is, um, this is the Deuce line from Thoroughgood. Great boot, bloodborne pathogen boot, pathogen, pathogen proof, proof, uh, side zip, waterproof. Great bottoms, self-cleaning bottoms, very aggressive bottoms. These bottoms are built with care, and they have technology put into these soles here. Um, they're not just slapping soles on these. I mean, this is made by the Weinbrenner Shoe Company in Thurgood, uh, I believe, in Wisconsin. They've been around since 1892. They're a very, very old company. They make a lot of union-made boots, USA-made boots, import boots, and, and so forth. So they're a great line as well. You want to come on down. Uh, for those of you that don't know this brand, you want to stop on down and just try these on. Again, I wore test these myself before we got these in. And uh, here we go with these in the store now. You know, since I like them so much, we, we brought them in. And again, it's the Deuce line. They're not a super expensive boot, but they're a great boot. We do quite a bit with these. And again, it's got the full side zip. And, uh, you know, just a great company. If there's ever an issue with these boots, you always bring them to me and we address it. And we, we notify the company and they, they take care of us and the customers very well. So we have these in the six inch as well, which is over here somewhere. Let me grab it. You can see. And I'm going to show you some others. And this is the six inch one. You can probably zoom in on that one as well by Thoroughgood. There's that one. Beautiful boot. You know, same type of sole. You know, there's all these little writings. Hard to see, but you can see it's all, it's got um, all this and, and things on the bottom. Self-cleaning, which I've never seen with a boot. Um, it's got self-cleaning. I would imagine that when you're stepping and when it dries up, you know, as you're stepping, you know, stuff just kind of falls off. It does have the bloodborne pathogen proof tag on them as well. So you want to come on down for those that like the that sporty performance look that you can wear all summer long, winter long. They're not insulated boots. They're waterproof, though. They'll keep your foot, you know, nice and dry and, and uh, you know, safe like that, you know, so they're not going to be sweating. And also, another big boot that we carry, and that's, this is a big boot. I think this is a size 15. We carry from very small to very large, but this is one that's on the display here. So you want to zoom in on that one. This is your polished toe, which you normally get when you do the academies and the, you go to the classes and whatnot. That's got your heel. These aren't cheater boots. These actually, you're going to strip these down and then you're going to actually put the shine on them as well. They come fairly shined already out of the box. So you want to stop on down those going to like the corrections academies and stuff. This is a great boot. I know some were using Rockies and some other brands. Um, we actually switched from Rockies to these guys because they're, I think, they're a much better comfort boot. Uh, you'll see when you when you put them on. It's your traditional police look. So you want to stop on down for these. Okay, and here's another great little shoe. Um, it's a full slip resistant. A lot of the the culinary guys and girls like this this shoe. It's got removable insole from Thoroughgood. Um, you can pull that out. It's got a real thick insole, real good cushiony insole in them. You can see how it goes right back in there, nice. Uh, it's got a good arch support over here as well. Full leather, made by Thoroughgood again. Got a semi shine to them too. If the guys that want a nice dress shoe, uh, working as servers and whatnot in the in the restaurants, or if you're a, a police officer or you're doing bike patrol, these are a great boot. Or I mean a shoe. I'm excuse me, and it's got full slip resistant bottom. You can see how the bottoms are on these. You know, very nice, very nice tread. Or I think it's oil resistant too, which means it's not going to break down on the bottom when you're stepping on petroleums which you know the the black tops and stuff tend to break that down this is a chukka boot you can actually see this boot here and i'm actually wearing these right now i've been wearing these and they actually sent these to us by mistake they were supposed to send us that shoe that i just showed you and here you see the one on the wall here right behind me here and um but again same features same insole but i like them I don't know you can see I'm wearing them just to show you. And it's my go-to shoe, my Carhartt socks. Um, but I've had these for several months now. They hold up really well. I don't really do anything with them. I, they're not, I, they're not, they don't say waterproof, but I've been out in the water 
with them snow blowing in the summer in the winter time and everything and they don't seem to be too cold or give me a problem where I'm, I'm worrying about my feet in them so and they're quick you know you just pull your it's got the little tab in the back where you put your your finger through and you kind of pull them up quick and over the years i've worn these as well these are the clogs company these are usa made footwear they're pretty inexpensive but they're a great shoe uh, compared to what the Sunitas run and whatnot. These are removable insole, very easy to clean these. They're an injected mold shoe, again, made in USA. And we get these fairly quickly. They're slip resistant. They got a wide heel base on them, so you're not the guys like myself that are tall, uh, you're not gonna really slip. I mean, you can see how, how wide that is. It's not small here, like a, a woman's heel, and some of the Sunita shoes are. But you can see how these ones are here. These are the slip-in ones called the Zest. These are the ones I, I wear, and the other ones, are these ones here? These have these are more like a, a Sanita style clog, a traditional cooking clog. It's got the heel in the back or the protection in the back here. Uh, it's fairly strong, but it's it's the rubbery kind here again. Same with the removable insole, slip resistant bottom, all the same features. Easy to clean with these. You know that's one thing when you're done with the day, you're in the kitchen, you're all messed up. You just take the insoles out, wash them in the sink quick with some soap and water, and you're you're good to go. So let me put these back. And then what we'll do is we're going to set back up over to the Sunita section. And we will show you some beautiful new Sunita clogs. And we'll show you the wall of Sunitas that we have here. We're probably one of the uh, only stores that carries the amount of the Sunitas that we do have here. We have a new distribution with, these, with, these brand, with this brand out of uh, Maine. So we get them very quickly when we do have to special order them. They are custom made. They're all handmade. They're made in Poland. So they're a very old company. It's a company we enjoy having here in the store. They're a quality company. They're collectible shoes. You generally don't throw these type of shoes out because they are not made overseas, um, quickly manufactured and just put in a box and sent to, to stores like us. These are handmade with care. You can go on the Sunita website and you can actually watch a video of how they actually put these shoes together. So give me a few minutes and we'll, or give me a few seconds actually, and we'll be set up over there in the Sunita section. Okay. Okay, now here we are at the Sunita wall when you come into the store. It's right to your left as you come in. When you come in, the way we have this set up now, it's very easy. Um, the top row up here, actually the top, top one is, is, these are gonna be size 36s the very top so when you come in from left to right you're going to see 36s and then you're going to see 37s on this on this next row from left to right these are what the options you're going to have then 38s left to right and there's a we got a, a bunch of 38s so anybody that is a size 7 to a seven and a half, we got a, a bunch of them you can back it up a little bit there you go and you can see from left to from left to right the selection of shoes here we have sold a lot of 39s, which are your eight, eight and a halfs. So we're kind of low on those, but we have some new ones that I'm going to show you in a second. I'm going to hand pick these. Um, and then, and then forties, we have some here and then 41s, which are size tens, women's tens. We have a whole bunch. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 12. There's like 15 or so, a different one. So if you're a size 10, you come in, you have this whole selection here. And then anybody that's an 11, a 10 and a half or so, the next one, and then a 12. I got a couple on the bottom that we have left in stock. We'll get some more of those in as we as we go. So, uh, so you want to stop in and, and check these out. They're they're great shoes. Again, they're all uh, very seldom do these shoes ever go on sale because these are when they're when they come in about two three months they're they're discontinued. They're on to the next print, so they become sought after. So some of these that we have here, some of the collectors that like the they like stores like us because we have some of the hard to find ones like the Cheetah one here. The skulls, we have ones with skulls on it that we'll show. But a new one that you want to zoom in on is this one. Uh, it's the Koi one. Beautiful shoe by Sunita. And if it doesn't say by Sunita, if you ask me, don't buy the shoe. You know, because I, I, there's nothing that compares to these to this brand here. So uh, great handmade shoe. You know, you can see the design on the little flower pattern. It's got some gray. Anybody that's working at Cooperstown Bassett that has to wear the charcoal gray, this is one that you want to maybe stop in for. 
Um, it's got a great pattern to it. And again, don't get stuck on, well, I'm wearing red pants. I got to find something that has red in it because you'll drive yourself crazy. You just want to wear uh, these shoes in and just don't worry about what print, you know, it kind of goes with. They're just a fun shoe. Um, if you're wearing navy blue pants, don't be afraid to wear a shoe like this um, or any color pant, really, if they don't match. You know, don't, don't freak out over it because they will look good. Another one that we got in, which is a new one, is there's a few of them actually, but this is this is a little different than what we normally get. You can zoom in on this one too. Um, it's it's kind of silver, but it's it's hard to see. It's got a little bit of sparkle to it. I don't know if you can see. You can kind of see it with the reflection. It's almost like a. It's got like little sparkles in there, like little salt. It almost looks like when you look at it, like you sprinkle salt all over. But this has got a different feel to it. It's almost got like a like a very soft brushed leather feel to it very soft it's much different than some of the other ones it's got the brown type bottom as well and the brown accenting up here and again all these sanitas are molded cup desi designed so if you push this you're going to widen that cup out so your heel's going to go in and it's not going to be tight if you want to tighten it you just hold this for maybe i say five six seconds you hold that and that'll tighten it in so when your heel goes in it kind of stays in there when you fit these i usually fit the girls my pinky is not to go beyond that you know so you have a little bit of room in the back just enough you never want to have this much room where you can submerge your whole finger and even i got big finger but I usually trust, I can tell right away if it's a good fit or not when they, the girls put them in. And, you know, you wear them, if they're really good when you first put them on, then they're great. If they, if you put them on and they seem a little snug, give them a few days, they break in. But they're a great shoe. Again, you never throw these shoes out unless they're very destroyed. You know, you, you I go, I know girls come in the other day, she had hers for five, six years. In fact, she had the Cheetah one when she came in. She's going to come back in. And I believe she was going to buy, I can't remember which one. I think it was this one, actually, she was trying on. So you want to stop in for that one. Uh, another one, which is a new one, which, uh, let me see. Well, we can pick one here. This is one. This is kind of neat. Uh, this actually has a little bit of, you can zoom in on this one, too. This actually has a little texture feel to it. Uh, this little swirly design that you got on here it's got like um it's got like a purple lavender there's seal blue obviously black there's gray this would look good with the gray outfits as well again another beautiful sunita handmade handmade shoe there it's all the same features same with the molded cup design and all that and another one i want to show are the ones they call the uh this uh what, what are they called the slip resistant these are the slip resistant one i think they're called the one steps or i have to look in the book and see but if you zoom in on this one these are the slip resistant bottom ones the other if they don't say slip resistant i'm not going to tell you that it's a slip resistant shoe the sunitas in general um they have good bottoms to them almost like a car tire but if it doesn't say slip resistant like it says here, I'm not going to tell the customers that they are slip resistant. They have to say that if you are required for slip resistance, you want to come in and we'll show you the ones here. I got some of these in, in black as well, but this is a beautiful one too. Look at the butterflies on that one. And it's kind of like a, a silver. It's hard to see here with the lights, but it's got like a silver, almost a silver tone in the background. Again, another one that would look great, great with, your, um, with your gray outfits for Bassett Cooperstown. This is a size 38. So I have those in 38s. Another crazy one we got here is this swirly pattern one. You can zoom back in on this one. Again, this is one of the slip resistant ones. You see the bottom on that one, Sunita, and you see the Denmark tag, the, the flag over here. And just a great shoe. I mean, look at that crazy thing. That's like, I'm a guitar player and I'd like to have my guitar look like that. You know, I uh, that's kind of wild. That's like the swirly swirly pattern i can't imagine these all being looking the same let's see if we can pull another one out here and yeah they're definitely all kind of one of a kind they all look a little different i got a few of these left in stock here too and i do have some of the old ones left in stock that are collectibles this is an old brush stroke one that anybody that's a size 42 a 10 10 and a half like that you might come in and get these because these are these are valuable shoes you don't find these anywhere this is called the brush stroke i call it got a brush stroke pattern on it it's got like little uh, strikes of like if you're painting you know 
But again, this is one of the original ones from, you know, probably five, six years ago we've had these. And sometimes I have these in the boxes. And, and the, before we, we had this configuration of how we do the sizes here, these would sit in boxes and I would forget about them. And they'd be down there until I just kind of go through the inventory and see what I have. The girls that need just standard black. I know a lot of the girls that work like maybe at the casinos or where you're able to just wear a good black shoe. Or you want a good server type shoe. These are very nice shoes. These have the tooled leather. It's hard to see, but it's it's got little leather designs in there. It's almost, I don't know, it's like flower patterns or something in there. Very soft leather. You want to come in for that one. That's a really nice one, too. And that's a fairly new one as well. And that one is a size 42. So got that one for some of the bigger size feet. And another one, if you want the slip resistant ones, if you want a nice one, girls and girls that work, that do work where you need slip resistance, um, that's the one you want right here in all black. Very easy to clean. It's got the shine. You know, same thing, all made in Poland, handmade. Great bottoms. These are medically stamped. They have the Podiatry Association on the fronts of all these boxes. And when you see that, it's just another another quality grade up for for a good foot, a good set of uh, shoes. You know, you want to always look for something like that, especially when you're paying good money for a a good set of shoes. You know, a good pair of shoes. And I do carry these for the guys as well. We don't do an awful lot uh, of these for the for the men, uh, but I, for you guys that really like these type of shoes, come in and we'll order you one. I'll size you up. I've tried them. I I like the other footwear that I kind of wear here in the store. Um, and again, you know, you want to have a good uh, set of socks with these. Uh, you can wear them barefoot. Uh, my wife wears these. She's got several pairs. Actually helps out her back quite a bit wearing better shoes, you know, and you'd be very surprised. And I'm just trying to look up here to see what other one I can show you here. Uh, these are kind of interesting. These are the skull ones. And I only have a few of these. You'll have to zoom in on this one. This is a size 38, and I have them in size 41. I got a few of these left, so you can zoom in on that one. And right off the bat, you probably don't notice until I say, "Yeah, there's skulls in there." You know, they're they're hard to see. I don't know if you can see that, but there's there's little skull patterns in there. If you hold it like this, you can actually see the skull design right here. And I'm going to show you another one that's an original one from years back. Some of the girls that, that ride Harley and and are like that, they. They seem to gravitate towards these. I only have one of these, I think, left. And this is a size 41. So anybody that's a size 10, look at this one. You want to come in for that one. I had a girl come in once. She bought two pairs of Sunnis. I said, oh, you like the skull pattern? She's like, what skull pattern? I said, the skulls you just bought. Oh, she goes. And you don't really notice it. I mean, this one's a little bit more noticeable with the skulls, but I suppose if you're looking down on it, you just think it's some sort of paisley print or something, some crazy design. And another one, I got some autism ones left too. I only have a few of these left. I've got these in 37, 38s, and 41s. Those of you that, that support for autism awareness and all that, these are a great shoe as well. Got a few customers that love these. They come in for these every year. Just to have them, you know, just to have that uh, awareness for autism. We do have some medical prints too. We get in with the autism awareness as well that we can, we can always get. You want to take a look at that one. I only got a size 41 in these. This is what the girl had. She had these for five years, and they still look like this. And and she's going to be coming back in, like I said, for the other one. But great shoe. Anybody that's into the leopard print. Um, Want to come in for that one? Again, size 41. Anybody that's like a 10, 10 and a half. And we'll do one more. We're going to do one more here. Uh, which one we want to show? Well, we'll show this one because this one's been around for a while. And I, I just realized I still had this one. So anybody that's a size six and a half, this is a really cool one. This is a collector too, the zebra stripe one. You're not going to see anybody really with this one anymore. Anybody that's a six and a half, maybe a size seven, you can probably fit into that one. It's just kind of a small one, but you can kind of see. And actually, these are on sale. So you come down, you look for the little tag, these little secret sale tags we put on the inside. We got to be careful how we advertise these for sale because they are high valued shoes. Um, they are price protected to to an extent with some of these shoes. So, but when you come in, you want to look and see if there's a, a tag in the back. Sometimes we have have ones here we've had for several years and we forget about. And we try to mark them down a little bit. So 
Folks, you want to come on down, 1311 Oriskany Street. We're trying to get back on television. We're making some deals now. We're going to be doing some commercials and whatnot for the next couple months. Once the weather breaks and all that, we, um, we get our enthusiasm to be cheerful and, and happy and outdoors and, and do TV shows and, and all that stuff. We're going to hopefully do some cooking shows. Um, so hope that you come down. We can service you locally here if you are a school if you are a hospital, if you are a local uh, department, a dentist office, or anything like that, our store is more than just medical. That's our tagline from many years ago when we started in 1997. So we will help you out in any way. We do manufacture some things ourselves. We make some chef jackets. We make some police gloves. We make some flashlights. We do make uh, some scrub lines that we have here on sale. Um, so there's a lot of things that we can do. You just got to ask us. We'll work out some account. We'll, we'll open up an account for you as we'll service you as locally. We try to stay within our area here in, in Oneida County, Herkimer County. Uh, I live down in the valley, so we try to stay local as much as we can. So we appreciate everybody that's been in the store for these past 22 years that's been coming in and out all these years. I'm always here. Um, so... Again, folks, as always, we hope to see you soon down here at Dr. Uniforms. What we do here at Healing Hands is create fashionable performance scrubs for nurses that makes them look and feel their best while maintaining a level of professionalism. In 1978, my brother and I started a women's fashion company called Crazy Cat Sportswear in the heart of Garment District in New York City. It was a lot of struggle the first few years, like any business, but then became very successful year after year. But then in 1997, I suffered a massive heart attack and almost died. By the grace of God, I survived open heart surgery. My father suffered a major heart attack and I was really concerned about his health. But believe it or not, this is what inspired him to start Healing Hands. While in recovery, as I was regaining my senses, I was very emotionally touched by the way these nurses were caring for me. Just like a family member, I truly felt they were healing angels. I started noticing and touching the ill-fitting stiff uniforms they were wearing. That's when I got this idea that if we make them proper fitting uniforms in luxurious, comfortable fabrics, they will feel good about themselves and their happiness will translate into even better care for the patients. We're always thinking about the customer and how to serve them better. So we created this new facility here with state-of-the-art technologies like RF scanning, location systems, and even robotics. This is all in an effort to get the customers their orders faster and ensure accuracy. I spend a lot of my time in the textile mills and engineer the fabrics from the yarn stage to create the perfect blend of stretch, drape, weight, moisture wicking and hand feel. Then I work with our design and technical team on the styling details and a good universal fit. The result is a fashionable and comfortable uniform that makes them look and feel their best. Ultimately the goal of Healing Hands is to make the nurses feel great and bring that positive energy to the patients. Healing Hands is dedicated to not only making the scrubs the best they can be, but making them the best in the industry.